Hi, it's me again with Krill Roll Tips and Tricks. When you use the bevel tool, you get something that looks like this. And you could play around with it for a long time. And we're just going to color it this gray and take away the outline. Go up to effects and bevel and bevel it, you know, a half of an inch. Play around with the attitude, the direction, the intensity. And you're going to get something like that. Um, where there are different colors because it's the lighting, you know, which way it's, which way you're putting the lighting. You could play around with it, but you would never get it as quick or as easy to do it this next way. And it would actually look like you've got rounded corners. So let's just make that. I'm going to draw the same rectangle. Doesn't really matter what size. We're going to make it eight. My ratio is locked, so it'll stay. I'm going to hit P. I am going to control D to make a duplicate. While holding down the shift key, I'm going to bring this in. And this is where you could, you know, maybe even make it more rounder looking. Then all you have to do is take your two-point line. And this is why it's important to work from the center of the page after you see what I'm going to do. So now we've got that section. We're going to fill that in with that gray. But then we're going to take the interactive fill tool and we're going to try to stay even, you know, at a right angle with this thing. Make that top part a little blacker and maybe do it like that. You've got to, it's got to kind of be even. So you want it at a right angle. Then you could actually take away, we're going to nudge that up. We're actually going to take this away. We're going to nudge that back. We're going to take away the outline. We're going to bring in some indexing lines that are in the center of the page. And then we're going to control D and make a duplicate and rotate this guy from the center of the page. Rotate it 90 degrees. Control D, control D. Now, take your Smart Fill tool on that same color, fill that in and take away the outline. That is pretty and sharp and pr uh, pretty cool. Uh, there is a little bit of a white line, but we could actually make that uh, like 101% bigger. Whoop, I put 10, 101. And it will take up that white line. That looks like it's a rounded corner obstacle. Much more, I think, than the bevel tool. Anyway, hope that helped. Thank you for watching.